selection this morning. You have credit cards in your pews. If you have a special request, something on your heart or on your mind, please uh, fill them out and hand them in. And they will be brought forward. They will be brought forward this morning. We need to continue to keep Lee Sharon in our thoughts and in our prayers. She continues in rehab, at uh, the Marlton Rehab next to the Virtual Marlton Hospital. That's uh, Phil and uh, Phil and Alice Anderson's daughter. Shirley Riker miraculously had a miraculous recovery and is home and is doing just is doing fantastic. She's doing very, very well. She had a short stay in the, in the Burlington Woods uh, rehab. She was only there two days. She was doing so well, she just went home. And we're, we're happy about that. We need to continue to be to keep in our thoughts and prayers the family of Brandy Ormsby and the Petite family. Uh, her life came to a tragic end on Wednesday uh, in a terrible automobile accident. In, in, in Del Grande, and she leaves her husband Joe and three children, uh, ages six, four, and two. Uh, uh, Joseph V, Madeline, and, and young Jack, who we've been praying for. Uh, earlier, he had had a shunt placed in his brain, he's doing, he's doing better in, in, in that regard, but again, we just need to keep this, this family in there. In our, in our thoughts and in our prayers. Amen. And there are a lot of needs in our church right now, uh, spoken and unspoken, and uh, we need the Lord. We thank God that He is faithful. Amen. Let's come before the Lord in an attitude of prayer this morning.
Lord Jesus, we ask you for forgiveness of our sins and for the new life which, which you offer to each of us. Your word says, because I'm in Christ, I'm altogether a new creation. The old is gone. The fresh and new has come. And Lord, help each of us in our hearts, in our homes, and in the church, Lord, to just to, to live, uh, to live this new life. We love you, Lord. We love you. And we need you. And we give you thanks and praise. We pray for every need that's on these prayer cards. We pray that as we are gathered here this morning, upstairs and downstairs, that you help us to, to hear your word, uh, that you help us to be everything you're calling us to be, that you, uh, that you uh, give us your spirit and just connect us to you and help us to follow you. Your word says, I keep my eyes always on the Lord. With him at my right hand, I will not be shaken. Lord, take us by the hand and lead us and guide us into, the, in, into your future for each of us. We ask this in your name. We love you, Lord. And Lord, whatever, uh, whatever needs we walk in this sanctuary with this morning, we thank you, Lord, that you are able to bless us beyond which we can ask or imagine. We ask this in your name. And we love you, Jesus. We love you, Lord. With our burdens, we ask for breakthroughs. We ask this in your name. We pray for our president. We pray for our governor. We pray for all in authority. We pray for every, every need that has been said out loud and every need that is on our hearts. We pray for... Asbury United Methodist Church that it may be a party of the kingdom of God in you. We pray that we may grow and uh, grow in you and, and, and reach out in love. We pray for all who are in uniform. We pray for uh, we pray for those who harm us. We pray for ISIS, Lord. We pray for uh, we pray for a world that just seems to get crazier and crazier. And we pray that your long arm, that your long arm, Lord, would just uh, would bless in ways beyond what you could ask or imagine. And we pray for peace in our time, O oh Lord. And as you have taught us, we pray together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Amen. For the ushers, please come forward as we wait upon God's time in our own.